Hello everybody. It's Monday and as you can see it's really sunny out but it's also really cold. It says it's 15 degrees right now but last night there was a wind chill of 21 degrees below zero so yay for that. They canceled school all over Michigan today because of these dangerous um, temperatures and up until noon today there was a winter weather advisory for the cold temperatures and this morning when I got up the water was frozen the water lines luckily turning on the uh, water and getting it moving it didn't take long before they unfroze but that would have been really really bad if they were froze so frozen solid because then we wouldn't have any water at all and we'd have a big problem trying to get it all unthawed frozen pipes are a common thing around here though how are you? Well, you know what I want to do to stick this piece here in the water in the utility closet. Yeah, well, luckily, only about five minutes after I realized there was no water, it came back. Yeah, well, because if water freezes here, that's not normal. Yeah. That's like, that would have been the third time in 11 years that it's done that. Well, and the reason he's saying that is because he took measures, precautions, to make it not freeze like this. See those up there? Those are the water lines. He ran them in the house so we don't get frozen pipes. So they don't freeze. Yeah, it's very rare for you to get a frozen water line here. Pretty clever idea. Yeah, well I think three times in 11 years I think that's pretty good. So. Yeah. So most people they have them running under their house and then they freeze. Well, Don didn't do it that way. No, well, we got one line under the house, but that's because it's the main water line. Well, yeah, coming from the well, well. It's a one inch water line, but by the time I insulated it, it ended up being that big round. But now it's <laughs> insulating. Yeah, so then I don't, you know, if something freezes here, it's rare. And it yeah. means it's really cold. But also the main water line has got heat tape on it too, so. Yeah. So if you've ever noticed this type type of thing in our videos, now you know why. This one runs right here to to the sink, to the kitchen sink. And we have the same thing in the bathroom. So there's a mystery solved for you. And it's the way to they may not be pretty, but it prevents our water from freezing and us having to go without water. So, it's a pretty good idea. Hello, kitty. One week. One week, Smokey. And you get to go to the vet. He's like, what's a vet? You're gonna find out. He's like, somebody <laughs> gonna take my molten oysters? Yeah. You want my molten oysters, he says. Yeah. So I know you can hear Gizzard, and that's because he has started to spray. So he, sometimes he's in here with food, water, and litter box. Not all the time, before anybody freaks out. Only when we uh, catch him going around trying to spray. Then he spends some time in here and then we let him back out again. But he's mad right now. But we can't have him spraying all over everything. Yeah, I know. You're okay in there though. You have everything you need and you're not in there 24 seven. You're good. One more week and you won't have to worry about it either. And I bought this stuff from Walmart to take care of the times when he did spray. It works amazingly. So, if you have any kind of problems with dogs or cats, this stuff, this works. You having fun doing the dishes? Yep. I'm being a twisted sister. Oh, yeah. And I'm making us bake chicken for dinner, baked potatoes, and I'll have some corn, and I don't know, he might want a different vegetable because he's sick of corn. And otherwise, we've just been staying in the house because it's so cold out there. We... Oh, yeah? Yeah. Fun. <laughs> but, otherwise it's been a pretty boring day. Okay. 
Yeah, it's so cold we have to have the heaters out too on top of the wood stove. And then we'll go to bed. Yeah, so yay when for I that. Felt, when I felt the wood stove, dampered it down. So. Yeah. Otherwise it gets down to like the middle 60s in here in the middle of the night. Yeah, that's too cold for in the house. So Don's working on finally putting this plant out here. He's putting it on the scaffolding. It wasn't doing any good for it to be sitting in that other room with no sun. It has to be right here by the window. But it is a lot of plant. Yeah, well look at the lot of plant I took out of it behind you. Yeah. These are like dead, dead vines and leaves. Crazy. There. I turned the lamp. That should help a little. And he's got hooks all over the ceiling because... From the old ones? Yeah, from other times he's had plants like this. He strews them everywhere. Okay, he has it almost done. He needs one more hook, but it goes all the way over there to the fish, above the fish tank. I found him one more hook so he can put this one up. But yeah, it is everywhere. So that's how they're supposed to be. Becky and Troy won't, we're not doing it right. They just had the whole, they had this scaffolding thing and some of it was on the scaffolding and the rest was just in a great big ball in this pot. And they were wondering why it was dying. That's not, uh, not how you're supposed to keep them. So dinner's almost done. And he is still working on the dishes. He took a break to work on the plant. Oh yeah? Yeah. Cool. <laughs> cool for you. Cool beans. Cool beans. What is this, 2001? Yeah. <laughs> Gotta have cool beans that we can have franken beans. Oh yeah. Yeah. Here's the chicken we're going to have. All it has on it is this. I didn't add salt or anything because this already has salt. Yeah, the first ingredient is salt. Don used to load meat up with salt and then put this on. That's too salty. It's gross. So it only needs this. And the potatoes are in here. Now they're done. And here's corn for me, which is going in next, and whatever vegetable Don makes for himself. There's the bowl for him. making jello. Peach jello and cherry jello. We need to buy more pudding, sugar-free pudding, but we have a lot of jello. Why? Oh, they're talking about needing pudding. 
Oh, shut up. <laughs> You're a pervert. No, you are thinking that that right away. No, you're really talking about it, not me. Oh, uh, so yeah. I just gotta carry on the conversation about it. Right. And that's what the jello gets divided into, one serving in each one of those things. So, this is probably a short one, but that's all right. Because nothing happened, and it was recommended that everybody stay home if they could today because of the Arctic temperatures, the frostbite risk. So, that's what we did. So we're gonna say good night and we hope you enjoyed the video and that you like and subscribe and you're having a good night. Say good night. Nope. I won't do that. Why? Because it's morning. No, it's not. Yeah, it is. Uh-uh. Three hours of the morning. Right. No, I'm right. It's not even nine o'clock. It's ten minutes to nine. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> okay. And we'll see you next time. Thank you.